To me, the smell of fresh made coffee is one of the greatest inventions. I'm a big goofball, you know. Don't tell anyone that. But I'm a big goofball. In Australia we call it a dag. Coming to terms with our true natures and who we really are has always been a fascination to humans. I know it fascinates me. It dawned on me that acting was what I wanted to do with my life. Nothing had ever touched my heart like acting did. For me that's one of the great indulgences in life. A hand-tailored suit and a great pair of handmade shoes. Anyone who thinks they're indispensable is fooling themselves. I'm an actor who believes we all have triggers to any stage of emotion. It's not always easy to find but it's still there. I just love making a fool out of myself. I made my living as a clown at kids' parties for about three years. I've always felt that if you back down from a fear, the ghost of that fear never goes away. It diminishes people. To get down to the quick of it, respect motivates me, not success. I feel so lucky to have both a son and a daughter because there's a different relationship with each of them. I never wanted to go longer than five years off the stage. Not necessarily musicals, but just doing a play or something. Salvatore Ferragamo have done some nice handmade suits for me. Being on Broadway is the modern equivalent of being a monk. I sleep a lot, eat a lot, and rest a lot. I have a wife and a son, but the gay rumors have started. I guess it's a sign that I'm moving up the ladder. You have to eat before you train. Otherwise, that really intense training. After about 40 minutes you start to flag. Your wife is always right. Very simple. I think I'm going to get it tattooed on my forehead. Actually, I graduated from university as a journalist. I've dreamt of being in a movie musical for a long time. For some reason I never even thought Lamies would be possible. But anyone who's done a musical knows, whether you're dancing or not, Physically it's the most difficult thing you can do. I have two children and it's amazing how in tune they are with nature, with light, with smells, with time. If I'm lush at anything, it's food and drink. I'm not materialistic in any way, but I value food. I've always felt embraced by the Broadway community even before I felt like I earned it. As you get older you have more respect and empathy for your parents. Now I have a great relationship with both of them. I like the Rolling Stones for karaoke. Sympathy for the devil is a great one. But in another world, Another life, probably growing up in another country, I might have been more of a dancer. That's all about the natural order of things. The idea of nature protecting children but also children protecting nature. I'm quite a competitive person, so I do quite like to win. My gosh, I love food. If I wasn't an actor, I could be a completely different body shape right now. I wanted to be a lawyer, then a journalist. Actually, I graduated from university as a journalist. When you dance, your body just wants to find its natural weight. 
I'm naturally a lot more Tommy Toon than I am Wolverine. My mom and I are, in many ways, quite similar. We're both creative, gregarious, and energetic. 